So this is 2156 South Compton in Mesa, 85209 in Suncrest at Augusta Ranch. This is a three bedroom, two bath, 1,704 square foot house we picked up this week at trustee sale for $112,001 and we got it $1 over opening bid. And a nice little archway uh, courtyard into the uh, garage with a side door into the house. So stucco appears to be in good shape. Don't appear to have any issues on the outside. The front is desert landscaping, so we'll just need to uh, prune these uh, bushes on the left side. On the front, uh, just get the irrigation back on and uh, trim up these uh, Take you inside. There is uh, people did leave in a bit of a hurry, so there's a bit of a little bit of mess in here. As we enter sections tile in the entrance way and into the kitchen where we have linoleum flooring, we'll need a paint change in the kitchen. Our two-tone paint color counters appear to be in good shape. We'll need a microwave. There is a fan, but I think we'll go for a microwave uh, fan unit the stove and dishwasher are in place. The sink is pretty beat up here so I think we'll need to get a new sink in this uh, kitchen and a uh, nice big double door uh, black fridge over here. So the ground floor I would just go in and put the uh, floating wood floor in this section. We're going to need two ceiling fans and blinds on the windows as well as the patio. This little nook is where we have the uh, the TV. Leads out to the backyard through this patio door. We have a closet here which we'll need. If we're going to do the, the floating floor we might as well just continue it in here. Like that. Have a garage. We'll need a garage door opener. We're missing the garage door opener in this house and uh, just clean out this debris that's in here. Hot water tank is in place and in good shape. So. We got the house for about $66 a square foot. So carpet on the way up the stairs and paint. So we'll do the two-tone paint Heading up in this area, we'll need a blind here at the top of the stairs and just carpet. So we'll start with a master. I have a ceiling fan. We're going to need blinds on all the windows and new carpet and new paint. And leads out to the master bathroom, which is double sink. So we'll just uh, need a new towel bar over here. And we've got a shower tub combination. So we'll just need to be cleaned up and have the toilet in here. So again, just paint and decent sized walk in closet. Um, need new carpet in here and uh, these are my favorite types of racks in the, in the closet but uh, we'll have to see if there's some, something else that can be added maybe in the back here to add a little more shelf space to it. So the cabinets are in good shape. Basically just carpet and paint here lines on these windows one two and three ceiling fan appears to be okay there's no light to it so I don't know if we'd want to change it and put something with a light to it hallway we have a double door linen closet and so just some new carpet in here and paint so to the right bedroom number two good sized bedroom connects to a Jack and Jill bathroom. So for the kids, missing a ceiling fan and a blind.
the washing, the laundry room is upstairs here. This will have to be cleaned up and painted. But it's nice to have the laundry up here where you don't have to bring the stuff downstairs. Kids bedroom number two. There appears to be a little bit of an issue up here in the corner. I'll have to check that out to see if that's an issue with the roof. Why it's leaking there. We're missing a ceiling fan and there are some decent blinds on these patio doors which lead up to the front. And so I think these are okay probably to keep in here. So just basically paint the door which leads into the Jack and Jill here. The linoleum is lifted up. So we'll probably have to change and there's obviously a big crack here. So we'll change the linoleum in the second bathroom upstairs. We'll need a uh, rod for the uh, shower and the towel rack is in place and the toilet paper is in place. The light is in good shape here. So basically in this room new linoleum and a pool. In bedroom number three we're going to need a ceiling fan and paint and carpet and look at this issue right by this vent as to why the uh, the this seems to be a little bit of a moisture. Um, in the hallway laundry room, just to clean up and paint, the linoleum appears to be in good shape, so that'll come up when it's cleaned. The kids' bedroom here, ceiling fan, paint, carpet, and a blind. So let's head downstairs and have a look in the backyard. Let me just see if we can get a vantage point here. We see it from any of the windows here, but you can see it over here. The community pool is just behind the property and it sits on this little green belt as well. So that's a nice feature. It's really not too far to walk to the pool. I'll just stop here and show you the entranceway, kitchen, nice area to put a couple of chairs, and then this living room area which will all be floating floor just a couple of fans here maybe a light fixture for dining over here and then a ceiling fan light fixture over here heading out through the patio doors we have a very large covered patio which is in good shape there's just one little hole here that'll have to be plugged and repainted other than that it appears to be in good shape there's very little to do here you would just reseed this grass here, get the irrigation system on and clean this debris up, but we should just get some new grass in this section back here and just clean up the rest, get rid of this wood here. There's no fireplace in here and then obviously the dog excrement, but it's not a large backyard, but it's, you know, for a rental in a small home by the pool, this is a great little area for kids to play or someone has a dog. And then a nice little area over here where for the entertaining and eating outside. Um, you know, this house will clean up very nicely. So this is 2156 South Compton in Mesa, 85209 in Suncrest at Augusta Ranch.